me! Oh, save me, me, please! Don't let him get me, me, please! Hello, hello. How are you? I got this uh, coffee mug, this new coffee mug, and it keeps the coffee hot in the mug. So it lasts like a couple hours sometimes. So you can, to the last sip, sometimes you, I forget about coffee. I'll make a coffee and just forget it exists. And I'll go back to it like 30, <clears throat> 30, 40 minutes later. And I'm like, what the hell? This isn't hot coffee. But no, this, this is a cool invention. You forgot coffee exists. Oh, you, okay. I see what you're doing. <laughs> Bro, not retired. <laughs> well, this is, this is an exception. Uh, House Flipper 2 is out. I, guys, do, do you really need me to tell you why I'm here? There's two, three very important reasons why I'm here. Number one, uh, House Flipper is my, I think my most streamed video game on stream. I think it is. I think it's like number one or number two. So I, I've, been, I've been anticipating House Flipper 2 just maybe like 10% under me being excited for the Elden Ring DLC. I wish that, I, I, I wish that they were both out right now. But I have no idea. Who knows when Elden Ring's gonna come out? And this is sponsored. Can you believe that? This is a, th this is gonna be an entire weekend of sponsored playing House Flipper 2. That's fucking awesome. So we're just gonna chill. We're gonna play it. The House Flipper devs are awesome. I, I, I'm just playing the game. Did they forgive you for being late? I hope so. Oh, but last night was so much fun. I, I'm still kind of recovering, if I'm honest. I, I woke up this morning. As part of the uh, the sponsors, they, they, they wanted me to be live earlier in the day. <clears throat> so I was like, that's fine. Yeah, that's cool. So I got up this morning and my like chest and stomach were just so painful. It's like, oh, it was like the Tin Man getting up. It was so funny. It was so fun. I keep having flashes of just the things that I thought were great. Uh, so it was really, really cool. I missed last stream. What did you do? You have a a you have a doozy. You have like 18 different streams to go potentially watch if you really wanted to. I love that event. I love the kind of house slipper invitational type stuff. Because if you wanted to, if you just watched my stream. That's all right. That's cool. You can see like the finished builds and you know all the the, the grading and um, some of the back and forth and all that. But you could see everybody build their houses, or whoever was live. Right? I don't think every single person was live, but <clears throat> but uh, but yeah, it's um, you get I, there's probably like a hundred plus hours of content if you wanted to have it. Hey, it's um, it's in the morning. I'm I'm hey, it's it's ten o'clock in the morning. My voice. It's a milk voice until like two o'clock in the afternoon. But it is so much. <sighs> the left side of my stomach is is tight today. But without further ado, thank you, House Flipper, for the sponsor. This is gonna be fun. I'm very interested. I wanna play, I wanna like start the game normally. We had kind of a, a wild evening last night. It was wild. I'd like to tone it down a little and just play the game, because there's a whole story mode. There's a whole game here, and I want to see it. So, we're going to start. All right. You guys ready? Let's play the game. I am excited. I'm ready to go. Let's do it. New game. Here we go. Euro-friendly hype. Yeah, I've got, I've got that contractually obligated EU hype. <laughs> okay, cool. I got... Oh! <laughs> I, that scared the shit out of me. Look who's decided to message me after all these years. So, you're interested in house flipping, and you came back to good old Pinnacove to find a job like that. There's dialogue options? Okay, how, is there... Um, I can't hear you. Are you on mute? Anyway, you asked about... I just, I just, I just, I just hung up on him. I'm afraid I don't have good news for you. <laughs> the town council put the renovation on hold. Which is a shame. He's not talking Turning to anybody. A community center was such a great idea, and now all we have is the ugliest house on this side of the coast. <laughs> it's a long story. The point is, this renovation isn't happening now. But don't worry, 
I got you another job instead. It's not as prestigious, but does this guy not know how a phone works? Right? Check your email for the details, and don't be a stranger again. Okay, because because I ended the call. That's so funny. All right, the email. Okay, this is emails. Because house number one, you had the computer, and the computer gave you jobs, and then you did the jobs and made money, and you could buy new houses. Okay, if your first job is waiting. I'm gonna press tab, open the emails tab. It's funny because I have not done any of this. We only were messing around in the sandbox mode to try to get ready for the event because we only had like a day or two to prepare. Like we were just trying to rush to get people aware of the sandbox mode. So I don't even, I, this is the first time I've ever seen this. Okay. So you want to be a house flipper. Okay. I've been tasked with selling this little house, but right now it's a totally a mess. I need someone to clean it up. I'm your guy. I were the interior designer for the first and last time she over decorated the house and left the windows to let the fresh air in, which wouldn't be that bad if only a raccoon didn't take it as an invitation to pay a visit. The aftermath is in the pictures. Interesting. All right, simple job, easy money. It's going to be tutorial. Let's see. How, how bad is it? <laughs> I kind of feel like this is the kind of thing that somebody would do to post to Reddit. But they did it themselves. Guys, a fucking raccoon got in my house. It was fucked up. And look what it did. And it has like 10,000 upvotes. You gotta get that Reddit gold. <laughs> a yellow quest icon means that there are quests nearby. To see a detailed quest list, press tab. Wait, there are, there are quests on the street. Don't know how to use your tool. Oh, no, no. I, from the demo, I remember this. Kind of vaguely. Look around for a book with Bessie the Beaver on the cover. Open it by pressing E to read some tool tips. Okay. So let's just tab, right click. Yeah, same thing as last time. Okay, key. There's a flipper sense. All right, cool. So, quests. Just trash and cleaning. Ah, okay. Well, let's go. Yeah, you have a trash bag in this one, which is interesting. And you, yeah, you actually have to throw it in the trash, right? You do, yeah. They're making you work. I'm gonna get all the trash first. And then I'll clean. That, that, that makes sense to me. Oh, I filled the bag already, shit. Can, can I bring this over here? Can I just drag this over? No, I got idea. Pick up all the trash, throw it outside. Then put it away. I would not... <laughs> I would not, like, do this on the, I would use, like, a mop. That's, uh, I love that there's, like, this progression here. I have a rag. If someone was coming to clean up uh, my house for a job, and I was like, oh, okay, cool. So, yeah, you getting ready to get started? Like, yep. And then just walking around going like this, it'd be like, oh, shit, you don't have, we have a mop? Bucket and a mop, yeah. But this is not a bucket and a mop. This is a, this is just a rag. <laughs> oh, watch out. That raccoon really, like, fucked up this kitchen. A rag and some spit. Yeah, that's what it feels like. Hey, wait, hey, we're starting somewhere, though. Oh, it... Does it... It contextually changes based on what surface you're on. Ah, okay, that's cool. There's no game audio? Oh, shit, let me turn it up. Because of uh, last night, it was turned down. So people could be in the call talking. It was dialed down from last night. That's better. Buy up so early? Because House Flipper 2 is out, and I'm sponsored to play it, and I want to play it, because I love this fucking franchise. Oh, I also see the uh, the people in the chat room right now uh, trying to get me to say uh, something on stream. Uh, during a sponsored segment, by the way, how dare you? <laughs> Honestly, if the devs watched the stream last night, that is incredibly fucking tame in comparison to what I would be saying if I said that. <laughs> no, they don't give this. They don't care. They're fucking cool. You gonna play Elden Ring DLC on stream? Yeah, I, I mean, I that is an automatic yes. It's so funny. I I believe every single streamer is their streams are all going to turn on at the same time when Elden Ring DLC is out. It actually might break. Twitch's platform. Like, that's the kind of shit where the, the the DLC launches and it's like, 
Oh, look, here we go. Press go live. And everybody's like, we fry a server. There's going to be like 600 million people streaming that game and playing that game at the same time. Everybody's playing House Flipper last night, too. Yeah. He loved to see that, too. What was the total? Uh, there was like 100,000 concurrent viewers last night across all the channels. You love to see it. This, that makes me so happy. How how many years has gone by of me telling people to play this fucking game? Play it. Play this game. Play it for the love of God. I've said it for like eight years. And here we are. House Flipper 2. And it's awesome. Oh, I finished. Okay, I finished up. And that means your client is happy with your work. You can finish the job now and get paid, but note that you have one star out of three. That's not good. No, I want... I'm a two star at least. Imagine the raccoon just jumped out and started fucking biting my face right now. Just like... <laughs> just take my arm, place it against the back right of this wall, cup with my hand, and pull to the left and drag everything down into the bear, into the bag. And do that to every shelf. This person loves fish, by the way. This is a very, this is a fish house. This is a, they got a theme here. Just want to fuck with them real quick. They'll never find that. It'll take them like a year. Hey, was that Discord post you were going to make an elaborate prank? No, I just, it's written, it's just, I haven't posted it. That's good. Why is the retired old man playing WarioWare? Oh, also, uh, I'm gonna Sir. make a post in the Discord at some point in the next few days. Uh, it's gonna be like a so long bad. paragraph, Andy, uh, explaining Keep exactly up, what that means. Because uh, every time I say the word retirement, no. people go, wait, what's Face happening? The ghost. And gotcha. uh, I wanna make it clear, kind of, what this. that means. I can just tell you right now. I can, okay, here, here, I'm gonna write it out for people to point to, so we don't have to keep talking about it over and over and over again. I want to be able to have mods be able to point to it and be like, "Look, this is what he said." And I know I'm I'm bad. I'm awful. I know I'm try. I I need to communicate better, and that's my fault. But in my defense, I feel like I've talked about it so much that it's okay if it, it takes another few days or another whatever week, whatever or a month or two a uh, year. Uh, just, how far can I throw? I hope somebody in the neighborhood was looking out the window. Because that would be fucking awesome to see that. Can you imagine seeing that out your front window? You're like, what's, what is the neighbor doing with the trash bag? And he just like throws it across his whole yard, gets it in and like jumps and screams. Alright, do you open up your window? Like if, if I'm over, if I'm in this house, do you pull the window up? And go, nice! What does that mean? Like, what are you, why are you looking at me? Why are you, why are you looking at me through your window? I don't know, what, right? Like, hey, excuse me, uh, why the fuck are you looking at me? I don't know. Am I on their computer? <laughs> I should not be on their computer. What am I selling? Oh, this is, okay. This is saying don't, uh, I have two stars right now. So, if I sell this stuff, I get more. This is part of the quest. Hold on, let me see if that works. Ghost, which fish was it? This one here? This one, right? Was that correct? Oops. Well, I sold the wrong one. Shit. These are like important family heirlooms or something, and I'm just selling them. Oh, shit. Okay, here we go. There's one dirty window. There's 50... Okay, that's cool. Cool, I gotta get it. It wants me to sell the live, laugh, love sign, which I agree. That thing's got to go. Where is it? Uh, I sell that, right? Ah, oh, that's one of the secret ones. Oh, it's just it's stuff in this room that I need to sell. Oh, shit. OK, hold on. Yep. OK. So just the picture and then that. That. And then there's a painting. OK, there you go. Nice. All right, there's a lot of stuff to sell in here. Not everything, though. All right, live. Where's the live, laugh, love sign? Get, okay, get rid of that. I, I, I am a. I, I'm. I get weird when I play this game because I have to do everything. It's like Luigi's Mansion. I, just, I can't help it. Everything must be completed. 
This, where are the two paint? Oh, there's stuff up here. That wasn't... Okay, that was it. Need a fish. Two paintings. A uh, vase. Uh, steering wheel fish. Bureau. Oh, uh, this is a this is a tutorial. As the game progresses, you'll get a chance to unlock cleaning spray. Use R to make the stains go away faster. Okay. Do I have to close this? Thank you for closing our window. We had no idea how to do it. Okay, lamp, vase, and... Oh, I think I know what that is. Yeah, that's over here. Right, that's like a... This one and this one. I think that's it. Three stars, 100%. We got it. No, it's two stars. Why? There's three stars, right? Am I missing anything? There's apparently a stain in here. Oh, it's all right. Finish the job. You will earn 2,000 coins. Yeah, it's just a tutorial. It's fine. It's the plant. The door. Wait, the door? Oh, shit. There it is. Thank you. Okay, cool. Yes, there we go. All right, we're done. I did everything. 100%. Sweet. Very cool. So now what can I do with the money? There's so many upgrades. There's so much progression. There's, so, there's such a drip feed. Okay, another email. Hello again. Thanks for your help at last time. Since you did so well, I have another job for you. I helped my friend buy her new home, and it seems she needs more... She's unpacking. Help unpacking her stuff. Okay. Easy. To be honest, I wish I could hire someone to do the unpacking for me. Actually, it's not a bad idea. Maybe you know someone. I'll do it. Oh, look at this little house. Alright, so you need help unpacking. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> that was really mean. Quests. Lost on what to do? No fear. Flipper senses here. Rooms with bright yellow quest markers have a quest waiting for you. Okay. That's helpful. <laughs> my chair just got electrocuted. I Hi, June here. You are my unpacking person, right? Mate. Should I hang up? And a cleaning person, I see. Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. I didn't expect Tom to act so fast, and I left everything as usual. I like to call it an artistic chaos. <laughs> So, artistic chaos. Maybe I'll just let you do your thing. And thanks again for your help. Bye. I know it's kind of funny. I, I kind of get that. I get that. My room looks way, way, way worse than this when I'm in the middle of a big project for a month. Food. You got a collecting trash perk point. You gained enough experience in collecting trash to get your first perk point. To use a press tab, go to the perks tab. Don't be afraid to experiment. You can always press reset and assign your points differently. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Oh. <gasps> oh wait. All right. Keep collecting trash. The bigger, the better. The trash bags can now fit so much trash. No need for all that running. So this, they hold more. Nice. Let's do it. Got it. Oh my goodness. There's, tra there's trash bags in here. All right, there, there's one thing that I I will not do. And that is uh like having a bag of trash that's full that has to go into the into the bin. It has to. And it's got to get out of the house. Like it has to. You ever sit around and you have a full trash bag? You have a full trash? You're sitting kind of in the room that has the trash can in it and you just like did I shit my pants or did I puke somewhere? Because like, what was going on? Why does it smell weird here? Did something did like it did? did why why does it smell like shitty in, in the house? And you go, no, it's a tra. Okay, take that out. I could never have a bag here. This is way the oh, there's one in here too. Okay, wait, that was empty. That was right there. Okay. All right, what about in here? I need quests. There's still a bunch of trash. Unpack boxes. Oh. Take item out. What is this? Oh, it's a cube. Here you go. 
That's the most logical place, right? I have to decorate too? I'm so good at this. <laughs> this would drive me insane if this was right here on the bed, on the headboard. All you would hear would just be, oh, it'd be in your nightmares, it'd be in your dreams. I cannot have an analog clock in my house. Forget about the joke and the meme about me not being able to read it when I was high that time. Five. 115. 145. Okay, this has a puzzle piece on it. Is that, uh, eight, eight, uh, 855? 855? 835? <laughs> what time is that? <laughs> what time is this? Oh, shit. Eight. <laughs> this is eight thirty-five. It's twenty-five. Fucking Jesus Christ! <laughs> what? Wait, what time is? <laughs> Shit! Oh no, my cup is gonna get blown here. In a second, my cover's about to be flown. <laughs> my cover's about to be flown. Uh -uh. <laughs> 8.26. Uh. Right, okay, 8.26. Good, my, my cover gets to stay not blown. Yeah, no, it's not. <laughs> it's 2.6 GPA. Uh, I may have, I may have had something. <laughs> but seriously, this sound, I hear it everywhere. I could be in, I could be across the entire room. I could be in a different room entirely. I'll still hear it. I know some people that's like, a, like nice and like rhythmic, therapeutic. Some people like that sound. Oh, get that off. Get it away from me. Captain Hook Andy. Make me laugh hard anymore. I la I laughed so hard last night. I'm in pain. What a, this is a bad placement on this. <laughs> that's so. That's such a funny specific fucking reference. Like, <laughs> oh. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, time time to eat dinner. Let's let me sit down at my nice like breakfast nook. Oh, there's a fucking microwave right in front of me. <laughs> Perfect reheating when it gets cold. That microwave placement is ass. Look, I was hired to come clean the house. No, no, I wasn't. That was the last job. I'm sorry, I'm doing this wrong. Uh I got the two jobs melded together. I'm here to unpack not to clean. And I'm cleaning, not unpacking correctly. There was a communication breakdown somewhere in those emails. I'll fix it. I, I'll fix it. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Hold on. <laughs> Ouch. I can't. Oh, I need to, I need to stop. Hey. You hear something? I'm sorry, but I can't work under these conditions. Actually, like, kind of... A, a, hear me out on this one. Just listen. Hear me out on this. <laughs> this is like... Is this a really that bad of a place to put this? In reality? I kind of feel like if I get home, I have a bunch of ships and going on all day, and it's like, oh, fuck. Oh, shit, it's 8 o'clock. All right, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. All right, but, hey, what's going on at 8 o'clock? All right, I, I know immediately. I'm not going to take my phone out. And you know what? Fucking digital bullshit. No, I, let's, go back to, let's go back to the fucking physical analog media. Put this outside. You're a crackhead. <laughs> 
Uh, dude, could I, you know what would be awesome if somebody made a clock house yesterday? That's okay. There's a potential to use the fishing rod tool and make a clock house where all the walls are just different size clocks and shit. All right, so I gotta let me rearrange. That's where the microwave goes. I know. Okay. 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 What are these? Different fucking like spell ingredients. Don't you think it's kind of funny that cooking is essentially like making a spell, like like a witch in a, in a brew? Oh, two, two crab's legs, one pinch of turmeric, and three leaves of bay. We, we're witches. We are witches. All of us. He's accusing us of witchcraft. Yeah? You, well, okay, what would you call it? Yeah. You're, you're, you're boiling, bubbling, toiling, and troubling with a bunch of ingredients in a boiling pot of water. What would you call that? Sir or madam, it's not magic. <laughs> Burn him at the stake. Burn him! Burn him! He's a witch! He's a witch! But my goodness, the, uh, the stew he made was fantastic. I haven't tasted carrots like this in ages, but did you see how he made it? He added a boiling pot with a cauldron. What am I doing? Did I clean everything? All right, everything's good out here. Oh my God! Oh, they're outside. Okay, that, that's that's still too close. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Yeah, you did a great job with everything, but um, why? Why were the clocks put? Uh, why were there clocks under the deck? Put them on the neighbor's house? <laughs> Can I put it on the neighbor's house? Oh, uh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm, I think because I'm in like the, the quest mode, I can't go anywhere else. Maybe on the tree? On the barrel? I don't know where I should put it. Ah, whatever. It doesn't matter. Put it in the barrel? I don't think I can pick it up as if it's trash. Let's see. No, I can't. I, I'm spending way too much try time trying to throw away a clock. Let me let me finish this quest. I always gotta have an extra. Always. Be honest. I want you to. I I want everyone to be honest. Do not lie to me. How many times have you guys realized that there was only like one or? You, okay, do you, let's go over this really quickly. There's a, there's a thing that we all do, well, and I say we all, but I'm going to just project on all of you, where you go into the bathroom, and you are like, okay, I'm going in here to do my business, right? You see how much toilet paper is left on the roll, and you do internal, like, 6 million IQ math of, there's not very much left on that roll, but I'm trying to calculate that I can, I think I can get the job done. And you sit there internalizing like, wait, mm, I don't know, but it, there's enough, but there's not enough. And you go through with it and you get halfway through and you go, this, I didn't fucking calculate this right. You'd love a bidet. I keep hearing that. And I know, look, I know this is like the invention of the telephone, right? I, Why would I do that? Well, I can just uh, talk to Gary in person. I would, I would never... Uh, calling Gary? What does that mean? I could talk to Gary. I have a voice to talk to Gary. Why would I call him? Uh, but here, I told... I, my thoughts about a bidet is... I feel like it would... I would be like, well, wet. It would just spray all over me and I'd be like, fucking wet and shit. It would have to it'd be awful, wouldn't it? Use paper towel. Use paper after. I get it. I get it. I am clean, though. Let me be very clear. I'm very clean. Thank you, House Slipper 2, for uh, the sponsor. I appreciate it. Uh, it's a great game. I'm having a lot of fun. Had a great event last night. <laughs> no, it's all good. This is cool. All right, so I think I'm good. I got three stars. Let's go. 2,400 coins. You should ask Ludwig about the bidet hesitancy. I feel like we've had a conversation about it, and he's just like, no, no, you you don't get it. He's like, you don't get it. 
Have you ever used a bidet? No, I, I, I find them to be revolting. What? Yes. Are you a bidet user? <sighs> this is... This is going to fracture us in a way. Are you sure? I, I, I need to be enlightened. Explain to me. So let me let me tell you what I think when I think of a bidet. Uh-huh. So when you, after you, you're done with the bathroom, if you go to the bathroom, you're finished. It's over. Turning a water jet into your asshole, wouldn't you get shit and poop water all over your legs and butt and stuff and have to make more work for yourself? I don't understand. Explain it to me. I need it. I need to know. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. That First of all, I'm not going to come at you. You just seem to be a little bit ignorant on, on all the positives. So I, I, I don't want to shame you. Is this like when you first played Dark Souls like 10 years ago and it's just like, I just died to the first enemy. I, this game sucks. Is it the same thing? Like you just don't get it. You don't get it. P just try, please. I got 5,000 bucks. What can I buy with this? Can I, where, where, where am I, by the way? Whose house is this? Is this my house? <laughs> What's happening? Wait, what? Whose house is this? This house is fucking crazy. Okay, I love this place. But I need it needs a little bit of work. Should I do that? I need I need to my own place is all fucked up. Let me spend a little bit of time. I mean, come on. This this is a, this is a, this is a, this is a disaster. Why do this painting's missing? This needs to be cleaned, needs to be repainted. Let me at least clean this room and replace some of this stuff. You're making the floor dirty. What? Am I? No, I'm not. Is that me? I guess it was. What's on your feet? I don't know, probably like plaster or something. American shoes inside. Uh, not in my place. Well, hold on. I I, ha I have a very specific rule. I've always had this specific rule, and that's if 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 it's a hard surface like a wood or a tile or something, then it's okay because it's easy to clean. But carpets, absolutely not. If there are carpets anywhere in the house or in the apartment, wherever wherever I've lived over the course of my life, right? It's always if it's carpet, then whatever room that is, do not go in there with shoes on ever. Carpets can get disgusting. Even if you vacuum, like, let's let, let, think of all the gross shit that you step in. Just walking around outside. And walking around on a tile floor, on a wooden floor, on an only floor, those are, that's fine. You can clean that very easily. You just get a mop or a little, scrub it up, it's easy. But you embed that shit into the fibers of your carpet. And they can go deep, too. If, especially if there's something on the bottom of your, of your shoe. It can go deep into the fibers, and then it just lives there forever. That's much faster, nice. No shoes on carpet, I agree, yeah. So I'm, but I, I'm not like too weird about it. People get it, right? It's like, oh, hey, by the way, like the carpeted rooms, uh, just shoes off in there, please. But not necessarily like a shoes at the door. I guess if, if the house or the apartment was clean recently, it's like, oh, I cleaned my house. I cleaned my apartment. Like, okay, then no, please put your shoes at the door. This, this place is, was just cleaned. Like I cleaned up. We did a bunch of work. I don't want you walking your fucking dog shit feet all over the house. Like, you stepped in dog shit. Like, leave that, put your shoes outside, please. When was the last time any of you guys stepped in dog shit? I brought this up, I know this is like repeated material, like from like five years ago. I, honestly, I feel like when I was younger, I feel like even older, I feel like I have a memory of this happening all the fucking time. I, this doesn't happen to me that much in the last five to ten years. But I feel like it used to happen all the time. I can't tell you the last time I stepped in dog shit and went like, God, oh, shit, come on, and had to like scrape my foot against the ground and do a pole. Yeah, I, I, are any mods here? I can do it if they're, if they're not, because it's still, it's pretty early. But uh, yeah, let's do a pole. I'll do, I'll do it. Pole. Um, when, when was the last time you stepped in dog shit? Uh, okay, within three months, six plus, wait, like six months, within, like, within the last three months, within the last six months, within two year, within a year, and then within two years. We'll do within three years, too. This is going to be like a three minute poll, who cares? Why is never not an option? Uh, that's true. If it's never, then just don't answer.
Oh boy, it's a mess in here. Oh my god. What about cat shit? Um, I don't know how you would be stepping in cat shit. Where are you? Are you... Cats usually go to the bathroom in a litter box? Why are you stepping in the litter box? <laughs> uh, oh my goodness. Okay. This, this, this place needs a lot of work. I think that's the point, though. All right, let me get my emails. All right, new quest. All right, we got a couple of things here. Which one should I do? Uh, during the years of miserable solitude, I paid little attention to the state of my chambers. This is going to change since a brave soul has recently joined me in all my adventures. In short, some ancient dirt and piles of trash await a truly fearless person to clear them out. Please arrive as fast as you can to help us and transform the forgotten dungeon under our living quarters. What? Making it worthy of my new companion's presence. I don't want to go here. You will be handsomely rewarded for your trouble. Just wait for us to return from a convention in which our party is participating right now. May luck be on your side. Robert Pattern. <laughs> Alright, that we're doing that one. Okay, we're either doing the dungeon quest or my room is a mess. I think we know what one we're doing. State of the state of the bedroom, I can't let him move in while it looks like that. <laughs> I, the little upside down emoji. That's ex that is perfect. So could you clean it up? I don't even know where to start. Let's take a look. <laughs> I thought, did he drive into the house? What happened? Oh, no, no, no. This is, is this the garage or is this like the fucking kitchen? Oh, okay. I think this is the garage. What about this one? Okay. Uh, it's not a dungeon. It's a like a game room. Burnout when exiting. Is that what it is? Hold on. Dude, that's... Okay, I want to laugh really hard right now, but I'm holding it in because the left side of my stomach is killing me from yesterday. But yeah, that is... That might not be going in. That in, That is probably going out. <laughs> how... Okay, how much in a rush do you have to be in? Because pulling out of your garage is not a majority of your trip. It's like maybe eight total seconds. You're not going to save time by peeling out of your garage. But we're gonna go here. We'll, we'll do the we'll do the dungeon one. All right. So most of the what was it? Three years, within three years, a thousand of you said majority were, were within three years. Okay. So I'm not crazy. Frame perfect garage exit speed run strat. Yeah. <sighs> this place is fine. This looks pretty good so far. What was the problem? This looks fine. All right, well, he tried to clean that up, but took one swipe with a rag and then said, nah, never mind. What is this? What the? What is that? All right, but the state of the bedroom. And then he wrote dot, dot, dot. The bedroom is fine. It's the living room that's the problem. M. Spinner. Wait, is that? <laughs> okay. I just keep thinking of the gamer streamer rooms from yesterday. It's like pizza boxes everywhere. Disgusting mess. All right. Well, as we, we enter the home, uh, we find that as we retreat from technology, we realize we actually just wanted it the whole time and we really just want to be alone with it. We have our gamer den and all our pizza boxes we've had delivered uh, sort of are all over the place. Our soda cans left. Uh, so it's it's, as, a as, it's a retreat from technology, but not at all. We, you actually really can't retreat from technology. Once you get out here, the 5G actually reaches here. You look at your phone, you still have Uber Eats. So you still got all this stuff. Oh, homie, welcome home. Turn around. Take a good look at our beautiful abode. It, it may be um, a bit smaller than you remember, but come on in. The uh, technological advancements have really come a long way. Welcome to our gamer house, homie Simpson. All right, on the left, you will see various electronomical uh, gizmos and gadgets of all kinds. Uh, you, you never see people say, oh yeah, like gamers and streamers. Here's a gamer and streamer room. Um, there's like math books and uh, like clean setup and 
uh, a place to uh, wipe your feet when you come in. No, it's just pizza boxes and puke stands. I was yelling at the TV like a dad watching the Super Bowl yesterday. Hey. Sometimes, hey, when you real, sometimes you become the dad. And you realize it. And you go, okay. Well, this is where we are now. Wait, did you say the Super Bowl? Wait. What Super Bowl? It's December. I don't follow football at all. But wait, wait, hold on. Like American football or, like, you know, football, like soccer. But... Is it called? That's not called the Super Bowl. Alternate timeline chatter. Yeah, I don't know much about football, but I do know the Super Bowl is in February. Wait, they're talking about what? He said, like the Super Bowl. He, they were comparing your stream yesterday to the Super Bowl. <laughs> Chat moves really fast. I Sometimes I, I have to fill in the blanks. Dude, you didn't even read half of it. <laughs> All right, what needs uh, trash? There's still trash in here? Where? Where? Liar. Got it all. Where is it? Where's this trash that I don't see? Am I missing something here? Where is it? What's your favorite Pokemon? Uh, the one that goes. Um. I don't know where the other two pieces of trash are, but maybe you'll find it in your playthrough of House Slipper Two. Out now on Steam. Am I? What am I missing here? Is there a room that I have not been in? Oh shit. Oh right, I. <laughs> I forgot this was the this was the dungeon. I, it wasn't the peel out house. Right, right, right. Okay, okay. Imagine if I ended it up there. I was like, no, I'm done. That was fun. Oh boy. Okay, yeah, yeah. Here's this is the mission here. Oh, the trash can down here. Good. Yeah, let's get rid of all this. This is technically not trash, but I mean it is. Can I even? Do you want to keep this man? I don't think you do. No. Pretty much everything down here has to go. At least the stuff that's all fucked up, right? Use the scanner to know what to sell. Ah, that's right. It contextually works for each tool. What? You want me to sell this? Why? What's wrong with this? You want me to sell both of them? Okay. There we go. Alright, what is this? Flipper tool. With this tool, you can first sell and then also modify items. As you progress in the game, you can unlock three extra modes apart from selling items. Duplicate, copy and paste, and change item style. Point at an item and the tips. Point at an item and tips on what you can do will show up at the bottom of the screen. Okay. I see. So I only have the sell mode right now. Still... Oh, I have to sell that? All the posters? We might want to get rid of all the posters. This is supposed to be a gamer room. That's why it's called House Slipper. This is very true. <laughs> this is I'm walking on this very weirdly. <laughs> uh, okay. Almost done. Where are the balls? This is, okay, there's two more balls. You're a creature. Alright, wait, here's one. You don't put the I yeah I know I know I know I know but I don't have any more. If you see another ball, you let me know. Is a ball? Where? Where do you see a ball? It's on the shelf. Okay. Ah, I see it. Yep. There we go. Cool. I'm still missing one. Hey, right, bro. Uh, can I get a re rack, please? <laughs> All right, the, I don't know what this is, but it kind of looks like like a missile dropped right there. Like uh, that's a grenade stain. All right, unpack the boxes. I don't want a one star review. Let's get this room to look better than it does right now. Turn the lights on. Oh shit! All right, we got books. We know where they're going. This is a little book? More books. Oh, I have this placed wrong. Sorry. Look, you can do your own book placement. It's not my job. Wait, these are games. Yeah, these don't... <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna keep it like that. I thought these were books. Hey, isn't a video game just a digital interactive book? No. 
All right. It's just you know, potential potential fictional worlds where you reading about somebody doing something, <clears throat> characters, uh, drama, action, dodge rolling, deception. Yeah. Well, you guys don't dodge around in real life when you read the part of the book where the main character is having a sword fight with the the major villain. And you you're dodging around your room while you're reading it. That looks good. Clean. I like it. All right, the bathrooms still need some work. Yeah, I'm just barely under three stars. What's the what's the problem here? There's still a box to unpack. Where? Oh shit! It's over there. What the hell is that toilet? Square? I, I yeah I've I've never seen a toilet like this. Maybe once. I kind of like that though. Oh TV. Okay, so that makes sense, right? Let's, let's, like, fucking take a bunch of hair off of everybody's eyebrows by, like, blowing out the speakers. Playing, like, fucking like, Skrillex through here. While people are sitting right here. Uh, is, it, is, it, is it a PC? Is it a console or a PC? I can't tell. You know, bring the box over here. What am I doing? TV is too close to the couch? I don't I disagree. I think that's a good view. That, that, actually, I would say it might even want to be closer. That would hurt so bad. That's... I, I feel like that's way too far. You don't think that's way too far away? Put it on the TV stand. Oh, you mean like over here? Yeah, but I want like a little gamer nook. Yeah, this is like a... Yeah, this is like a 24-inch TV. That would... <laughs> oh, you're telling me that you... This is a viewing angle for a TV light? I... I can't... I can't see what's going on. What's the table for? I think it's just tables have it. Just table. Nice. This, I want this person to be able to participate, not sit against the wall. What? Why is everybody laughing at me? Why is everybody? I'm looking at everybody going, "You are. What's wrong with you? What? What's wrong with you? What? Make the sofa face the wall. I, I can't see the TV from back here. You want to? See, what? What television show could you watch from back here? Your your feng shui sucks. I don't want to. But I'm gonna get a neck cramp if I what I can sit here. I'm gonna sit down and go like this and look, turn my head to the left. No, I want to sit here to be able to see what's happening and put my feet up on this rest thing and be able to see what I'm doing. Hey, they can move it if they want. I'm making this for me, not them. Yeah, if somebody wants to squat on this, they can. You can like squat here and look. But this is where I sit. Ah, uh, that's it. I'm good. Look, it doesn't matter, because if anybody was sitting here... Yes, I know. Like, the grand fucking Count Dracula gets to watch TV and you don't. But you're not going to be able to see anything from here. I'm good. Cool. Is it before and after? That's a good question. I don't know. Maybe for certain missions, or maybe not the first few missions. Maybe not. Maybe it's not in the game. Check in the settings. Let's see. Gameplay. Mods on. Controls. Key bindings. Display. I think... Maybe it's for different missions or certain missions. I think that was in the base game, but <clears throat> something to keep in mind, too, is uh, House Slipper 1 had, god, what, like six expansions and like nine DLC packs or something, so I have to unpack my own stuff. Okay, what is... Ooh, wait a minute. Can I actually build this? What? Are you serious? You can actually do this? You can build a whole huge thing? Is it weird if I want my house to just have no furniture? And the only thing that it is is a gigantic truck for the little car to go around. I don't even want a bed. I, all I'm saying, all I'm saying, I'm just gonna, all I'm saying, can you imagine if you could actually have the train work? That would be fucking ridiculous. That's something a 40 year old dad would say. Uh, do you know how old I am? That's so cute. That really is cool. I'm thinking build a giant track that goes up here and around here, down the stairs. I don't want this house to be lived in. I want it to be a giant toy. 
All right, new job. Make Pee Wee's Playhouse. I'm sure it'll evolve into that eventually. All right, we can do the uh, the guy that peeled out of his garage. Or, hi, I'm selling my house and I was told that it has to be cleaned first, even the basement. This real estate agent who was a regular in my cafe recommended your services. I probably forgot to take some stuff, so if you find any packed boxes, just leave them there. Okay. I'll pick them up at some point. Have a lovely day. Okay. It's kind of a mess, yeah. Uh, let's go do the peel out house. So this is, this is my house. Oh, okay, here we go. On sale. Nothing right now. What's this? Sold. I bet I have to unlock this. Uh, let's do the peel out job. This is a wild house. The whole bottom floor is... Wait, okay, this is the front door? Whoa, that's, this is interesting. The whole house is a garage. What's in here? The bathroom? What the fuck is going on here? Okay, laundry, yeah. No entry. Say my king? No entry. Well, I can't go in there. I'm not allowed to. You ever clean your room and pretend it's a house flipper job? I thought about this the uh, honestly pretty recently, just because I knew this game was coming out, and yeah, I I, I don't know why. It just... Hi, Stephen here, the unfortunate owner of the house you've agreed to clean. So, how are you doing? You're still up for the job, right? Or did the garbage dump in my roommate's room scare you off? I'm in the house right now. Uh, I've seen worse than this. Really? Wow. I didn't think that was even possible. The world never stops to amaze me. Usually not in a good way. But to the point, I have one more request. I had a microwave, which disappeared mysteriously some time ago. If you'd find it in his room, could you move it to the kitchen? I have it since I went to college. It would be a pity to lose it now. <laughs> that is such a weird thing to want. Yeah, how, how do you have a sentimental microwave? <laughs> Should I just hang up on him? Why didn't you get it back? I make no promises. I mean, you're going to pay me more money? Let's find out because I know where it is. It's not like I have to go look for it. I'm looking at it right now. If I get an extra hundred bucks for doing this, why wouldn't I? Thank you so much. I like that model quite a bit. The new ones look weirdly complicated. That's it, I guess. Good luck with the cleaning. I think I'm gonna hang up now. Bye. You want the plate in there too? Cool. All right, that's what I had to do, right? I'm trying to throw a watermelon out the window, don't mind me. What? Oh, sus. <laughs> This guy's an Among Us fan. We definitely hit that on the way out. I just realized something. This is a weird driveway. I, you're going to hit this... How do you get to the street? <laughs> That's so funny. He has to jump the curb. <laughs> He's going to hit that pole, too. You drive down the sidewalk, I guess? <laughs> Just drive down this way. Sell. <clears throat> perk point. Perk point. Perk point. Let's go. You can duplicate items. Do you need some extra chairs for this party? Uh, yep. Can you do the Pee Wee Herman dance to this, please? I was only under obligation to do the Pee Wee Herman dance. Uh, one time, and I did it. Risk on. And that clip will live uh, until all the servers are turned off on the internet, whenever that is. And in a thousand years, if the servers are still turned on, if, if you, you can still use the internet in 10,000 years, that clip will still exist. Isn't that fucking terrifying? There'll, there'll be people that, um, that would be making fun of me 10,000 years from now. I can't believe he did the Pee Wee Herman dance. 
That's how aliens left. I don't know. Who still who lives here in 10,000 years? Is it humans? I don't know. We'd be lucky we make another 500, let alone 10,000. He's getting existential. He's getting existential. 10,000 years from now. Think about how many people will have existed. It's going to be crazy. Think of the database of just of like the trillions of fucking people that have lived. What happens? That's a long time. Okay, time for the roommate room. Are you retiring because you have to leave to your home planet? Yes, I've collected the data that I need. Mr. Freeman. Thank you for being so cooperative during my time here on Earth. I very much appreciate it. My findings will go to the Grand Emperor. My brain will be removed and blended up and then spread across a microscope and then connected to three or four thousand different computers to make sure they don't miss anything. So I bid you adieu. Delete the bed. I, please delete the bed. I'm going to barf if I look at it. <laughs> delete the bed. Don't clean the bed. I don't know if I'm clean. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, dude. I think if I come in here and I see that, I will text the dude and say, hey, um, look, I, I'm just going to throw the bed away. And I'm willing to even like go like half with you on it because like I ain't fucking touching that, man. Like, you can take a little bit out, but I ain't touching it. It's just mildew. I know. <laughs> Stop scrapping his posters. Well, the roommate told me I had to. The roommate's like, get rid of all his shit. These are, these are nice monitors. I mean, I guess I am selling them. It's not like I'm throwing them away. So somebody else is going to get these. I guess technically for someone to sell it, someone needs to buy it. So somebody's buying this. What is that? This dude didn't put like a turd on his bookshelf, right? Yeah, I'm uh, saving that one for later. I just want to make sure I keep it for a while. It's a sliver of bacon? It's probably what it actually is. This looks like a carpet. This looks like a a carpet, like a really low... Uh, what's it, what do they call it? When the fibers aren't really that tall? It looks like one of those floors that you see at like a... I don't know. Establishment. You know? That looks like one of those kind of like carpets you see at establishment. You know? <laughs> Low shag. Yeah, that's what it is. Did I turn off the squeegee sounds? Because that, that's like my favorite noise. It goes... I'll do it myself if they're not in the game. Jeremy, I just wanted to get this message to you. Uh, Talix lied to you. That image was from Harry Potter. They just lied to you and made you think it wasn't. That was actually from Harry Potter. They just want people want to make you feel like you were stupid. That was that. That was right, right? Okay. Yep. Yep. I got it. <laughs> the saying? fellowship is supporting you from the yeah, door that you came you. in. No, no, no. That's afterward. <laughs> that's the aftermath of defeating the troll. You're, that's Harry Potter. A cut scene. That's not even the same no, movie. That's the, troll, that's the game troll. You're skipping the cutscene. The, oh. the fellowship's <laughs> behind you. Behind you. The door you oh, came in. Oh, there. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Look, yeah. Now they're writing their arrows. The cave troll's coming. Okay, now and then you fight them. <laughs> I fight the cave troll. <laughs> the the T posing cave troll. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck, it hurts. Okay. <laughs> this is for after you've defeated the cave troll. Bro, that's but, not Harry Potter? <laughs> no, no, this is Lord of the Rings. You don't oh, see it. Wait, wait. They, they, they stick a, a, a splinter up his nose and then he falls over. I'm so fucked like the up. Movie. I, thought, I don't know. I thought that was like fucking Harry, like right no. on his head, like, like sticking up. <laughs> I don't know. I was like, that didn't happen, did it? Okay. No, it didn't happen. All right. They I have did. taken the bridge. So I was right. Everybody was like, no, he's, oh, he's Jerba. He's, you know, his brain is, he takes him a little while longer. He, everybody thought I was stupid. So you were all doing that on purpose. Okay, I get it. What happens if you point this at yourself? I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I never thought about that. Like, if I, if I open my mouth and hold this with the laser pointed right at one of my teeth, will it just sell one of my teeth? Will one of my teeth just disappear? Or will it decide that it's the whole entire person? That's a good question. 
Where's this last piece of trash in here? Where is it? Nothing behind the bed. In the drawers? Oh, there it is. Yep. Okay, like, uh, the Wily Coyote was just sawing underneath me in a circle. The door not being able to close is brutal. <laughs> Wait, it can't. Is that a flaw in the room or is that a flaw in me? Me. Oh, hold on. Maybe this is, maybe it's mad that I didn't throw these away. No. Everything's done in here. Everything's done in here. Oh, there's another room I didn't see. Thank goodness I looked at it. over it it's so stupid but it's true i hate that noise so yeah that's fine i i have maybe a little bit i maybe like a, like a little captain hook all right there we go perfect everything is completed let's go could you play some dubstep for us yeah <laughs> It's like a sample that I had on my computer. What's your producer tag? Um, I don't have one. I release all of my music anonymously. All right, this seems like it's probably one of the last starter ones. All right, so this is just a clean house. Let me give me the pictures too. Yeah, it's just a mess, especially the basement. Let's do it. Drukey told me you once called us freaks long ago. What's up with that? I think I, I've called you a freak uh, probably a hundred times in the last three or four weeks. <laughs> Fuck you too. <laughs> Wait, we're freaks? No, not all of you. Not everybody's a freak. Who is though? Well, I, how many people are here? I'd have to go down the list of every viewer and just say if they are or are not a freak. And I mean, I could, but it would take probably 60 to 70 hours. So, well, maybe probably 150 hours with 12,000, 13,000 people. What is it? Yeah, if I individually, if I, each each person gets five minutes to determine if you're a freak or not, that's five minutes times 12,000, which like a, a year. We could probably get it done. I'll save you some time. I am. All right, let's save some time. Uh, we get a poll in the chat here. Let's do, uh, are you a freak or not? Just so we can, because I it's going to be a long time to go through them all, so. This is going to help me a lot because when we actually, when we do it, it's, uh, I just don't have to, all the usernames that say yes or no, I don't have, you know, I can split them up. I really appreciate it though. Saving me a lot of time. All right, I'm going to start at the bottom this time. It was even the basement, even the basement. So we're going to go there. I wonder what the problem with the basement is. Bathroom is immaculate. There's nothing wrong with this at all. It kind of scares me because it's very, very dirty in the rest of the house, which kind of leads me to believe I mean, this is kind of... Look at this. Um... No, it's, never mind. It's not that bad. It, it could be worse. Nice. Trash bags can now fit much more trash. No need for all that running. Okay, good. The overwhelming majority of germamites are freaky. <laughs> That's what a chat member said. I didn't say that. Hey, freak. Freaky. Freak, but respectful. Come on. Freaky Friday. You know what I would... Okay, in a situation like, let's say, all right, like, let's say me and Stir. I'm just going to name a random person that I know. We, like, ran into each other at full speed, and he became me and I became him. Uh, I'm telling you, in that situation, I'm not fucking around. I am going to say, look, Stir, uh, right now I'm I'm you and you're me, and I'm going to go sit down in a, in a comfortable spot and give myself, like, a, like, a, like 10 feet by 10 feet space where I get myself a telephone, um, 
get myself like food and stuff. I am not moving. I'm not doing anything. I'm not touching any of their stuff. I'm not going to go and I'm, I'm literally going to sit in a fucking spot until we figure it out. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. We are going to we are going to sit there and we're going to figure it out. No, like, oh my God, ha, ha, no, I live Stir's life. No, 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 Stir. So you and I sit the fuck down. We're not going anywhere until this is done. Yeah, knowing Stir, the second we switch bodies, it's like, whoa, Freaky Friday, we just switched bodies. Okay, let's, by the time I say, okay, hold on a sec, by the time the S comes out, he's already sprinted out of the room. I'm going to have to chase him down. So he said, what Looney Tunes character are you? Uh, I think Daffy Duck and I are very, very connected. All the cartoon ducks I, 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 I relate to. I got Donald Duck. Oh my goodness, I get it. I get it. Everything enrages me. I'm just everything. I, I'm so annoyed by so many fucking things in this world. Uh, Daffy Duck. I like, I, I like just having fun. I don't give a fuck about very many things, whatever. Uh, duck Man. You know what I mean? Uh, what other uh, fictional ducks are there? Howard the Duck. Oh, yeah. If you're a fictional duck, I probably relate to you. Darkwing Duck, absolutely. Scrooge McDuck, 100%. What about Psyduck? I don't know anything about Psyduck besides. Am I, is this is this wrong? But like when I th when I hear I see a yellow duck, Psyduck is a yellow duck, and I, and I see his hands up, on his head. Both of his hands are on his on his temples, kind of going. Is that the right character? Yeah. What are some of Psyduck's moves? Because let's figure this out. He's dumb and always has a migraine. Uh, I probably could... If you asked me to give you like a three-word sentence on who I am, dumb with a bunch of migraines, that's... That, that you could... That could come out. I don't know how completely accurate that is. I'm dumb a lot in a lot of things. But... Yeah, I relate. Oops. You can sprint even if you carry something in your hand. I was going to say, yeah, I was moving slow. Oh, you're not dumb? Uh, I don't think I'm dumb. But I'm, I'm of the opinion that I, I feel like I self-deprecate a lot because I don't want to inflate so high that I maybe I am dumb. And I like I'm essentially saying I'm not. There's, there's very few cases where I actually genuinely want people to think that I like, oh, I know so much more than you do. I, I don't, I don't fucking care. I, you know what I mean? I just don't. Empty brain. <laughs> no. Vacuuming. Some trash is too small to pick up by hand. That's where the vacuum cleaner comes in. When you come across a pile of broken glass, tiny bits of brick or anything else you can't put into a trash bag. Vacuum. Ah. Nice. So that's how you get the little pieces of glass. He's too used to the blood to notice it. You mean the one on the window? Dude, how cool is Squeaks' house? That little murder mystery was so fucking clever. It was awesome. Spoilers! Oh, you didn't see it yet. Well, hey, the... Hey. I guess that did happen literally like 12 hours ago. Hey, don't worry. There were... There were 24 houses last night. Can you believe that? We saw 24 different builds. That was so fun. I was still laughing about Connor on the train this morning. I, I woke up. There was like 10 to 20 different distinct my stomach hurts moments from last night. That's one of the funniest things I think I've seen in a long time. So you can like hear the fucking conductor in the background when Sea Dog is talking about what he's and you can't even understand him. And Conrad's pants is like, yeah, yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's totally true, dude. And if nobody could understand a single thing he was fucking saying. <laughs> so, spoilers, I'm sorry, I know, but like, I have to talk about it because I just, it just happened. It was so, it was too funny. Don't worry. There's like 30 of those last night of where, like, it was hysterical. At one point, I think you could hear like, and then you hear the train moving. It's just, God. <laughs> like, where was he going? Where was he? Where, like, where was he going? He was, at, at one moment, he was, he was in the stream, and he's like, hey, I gotta run. It's like, oh, okay, but hold on, he's still here, and he's, like, traveling. Oh, it was so fucking funny. Yeah, the passengers on the train are just listening to this guy, like, 
Yeah, so uh, when you go down to hell, uh, yeah, we, we've died. Uh, and, and when you go down there, I'm trying to do a sea dog impression. Let's see. My voice is not nearly smooth enough to do this, but. Yeah, so if, I think Connor's actually in the call. If Connor wants to unmute, and uh, he's he's a bit busy though, but maybe he can explain really quickly the inspiration for hell on the on the the home. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear me right now. I'm on a, oh, on a bullet is, yeah. train. Yep. No, you're good. We hear you loud and clear. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Good. Good. I mean, I just had a fine off a train conductor. I'm gonna check my ticket. The point is. Is that we we are living in a hell. This is the situation for building hell. Well, I don't find this very funny. I don't know why you're laughing. Why are you laughing? This is serious. This is the most serious part of the build, actually. <laughs> I'm laughing because you're calling in from a train. Talking about like how you're both burning in hell oh, in this house. Yeah, that's your default. That's, that's okay. I'm, we're, oh, we're not sorry. burning in hell yet, to be fair. No, no, no. <laughs> it's just oh, okay. Right, the, sorry, sorry, it's, sorry. It's, that was fucking amazing. All right, go ahead. Gone. <laughs> um. Yeah. So I, I really wanted to build hell. So see, we, we have some paintings. Well, I mean, it turns out that the paintings don't want to go on the ground. So it was an absolutely nothing to get that uh, kind of vibe. But I think that also encapsulates what you're going to yeah, no, I agree with that. With that. Um, you want to see a fucking thing that I'm saying? No, loud and clear. Thank you, Connor. Thank I'm you. I'm losing my mind. No, you're doing great. No, we appreciate him. That was great. So yeah, you can keep walking through <laughs> hell there. Hell, go to the end of hell. Go to the end of hell. Is, I got bad news like, about the I end of hell, this Connor. One. This one's fucking amazing. It's just the whole everything going on right now is un unbelievable. All right, okay, what's thank you? Go? Keep walking. He must have just sounded ridiculous. People. I don't, what the hell do you even you look at that guy and go, what the fuck is he talking about? Yeah, so when we go to my funeral, your fun why is this guy talking about his, what's, what do you mean your funeral? You're alive, what? Oh, he's in Japan. <laughs> That's right. It just, it probably, it just sounded like a guy on the train. I forgot he was in Japan. That's right. <laughs> yeah, but, but, for the, but there's, there's plenty of English uh, speakers in Japan. If you could speak English in Japan, you... It, that was a that was an interesting train ride. If Boston boy forgets there's other countries outside. I did not say that. I I just said I I it slipped my mind that that's right. He is in Japan. I know that Japan exists, and I know I know that Connor lives in Japan, but it was one of those like oh oh that's right he is in okay that's right. Do you like Boston cream pies? No. I don't like custard. Sorry, bro. I don't like the, the kind of custard that's in a Boston cream pie. You're fake Bostonian. Well, let me give you, can I give you the reasons why? I, this, this is, this is not just for this type of food. I like, for like, like a, a sweet dessert. I don't want it to be, there's a point where it's either, it's in that weird in between of being too thin, but thick at the same time. And I don't like that. It's still kind. It's 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 like a viscous liquid. It's not fluffy. I really only like fluffy stuff, kind of like a custard type sweets. I don't really like runny. Like custard is kind of. It's not. It's got a weird kind of gel kind of texture to it. I like fluffy. You either got to go one or the other, fluffy, or all the way. It's like a it's like a liquid, like a milkshake or something. That in between is just something I don't, really, I don't really like. What about yeah, pudding? Pudding is kind of like that too. I don't, I'm not a big fan of pudding. It's like that gelatin kind of texture. But, but wait, wait a second, wait. If you transform pudding into frozen pudding, like a pudding pop, it it is now a different substance. It's no longer that weird kind of cold gel-like substance. It is now a frozen pudding pop. And oh my god, guys, they don't really make them anymore. But all you need is a package of chocolate pudding, a package of vanilla instant pudding. You just mix it up with milk. It's so easy to do. 
uh, put it into like a little a little piper thing to like like squeeze it into a um into a mold for popsicles. Put a couple sticks in it, and let me tell you right now, that's oh my god, you make your own pudding pops. Did you grow up in the fifties? You just don't get it, and that's all right, and I understand, but you just don't get it. And if you will, if you have one, and it's okay if yeah, you just you you don't get it. Get a bidet, right? You don't get it. All right, why do I have one star? Oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Yep, it's members. It's just like, oh, the basement is fucked up. Can you repeat the recipe, please? I only mentally chimed in when you said pudding pop. <laughs> uh, There's a couple of just really easy ones that can give you exact stuff, but it really is just an, a package of instant pudding. Um, Like a cup of milk? Just dairy, like regular milk? I don't know if you can make it with milk substitutes. I've never really tried, but you might be able to. I mean, like frozen stuff so much. I don't know. That's a good question. I think it's always been like that. I've always just loved ice cream and popsicles and dude. <laughs> okay. You guys know those freeze pops? They're the stick and it's literally liquid. It's they they sell them in a massive box. There's like a thousand of them in a box. Those are amazing. And I remember one time I bought a box of those and it was hundreds, it was hundreds, it was hundreds of them. Had to have been at least a few hundred in a box. I bought a huge one and I ate the whole entire thing over the course of like, a, I think like a, like a couple of years. I had every single one over the course of like three years. It was just so easy to be like, yeah, I want a snack. What do I want today? Oh. Well, that was very easy because I'm going to have a freeze pop. It's so simple. It's right there. Just snip off the top and you're done. That's a long time. I may be embellishing a little, but it was a very, it was an extended period and I ate a hundred of them. Frozen grapes are better alternative. But yeah, as I've gotten a little older, you know, it's not like, oh, I eat cookies and candies and sweets and oh, Willy Wonka. Oh, I love uh Spoojizzles and, and gobstoppers and no. Like, I, have, I mean, I'm almost 40. I can't, like, just eat trash every day. Although I say that, but they always say, I'm trying to eat better, trying to eat better. What about cheesecake? Cheesecake is uh, incredible. A cheesecake with raspberry sauce. That's, uh, it's, it's up there uh, at, at S tier. I don't know what I put cheesecake at, like, five years ago when I did that tier list about desserts. I don't, I don't even know if it was on it, but it is... It is S tier. My joke was so funny, the mods kept it for themselves. <laughs> That's a really fun way to say that you got banned for 10 minutes. <laughs> I can wear the, wear the cleaning sounds. Oh, sorry. Outside in the backyard. All right, I got three, but I'm going to do the whole thing because I feel like it. That's it. Three stars. Thank you. All right, I'm curious what happens now. Hey, sound effect boy. What am I paying you for? Get back to squeaking now. Hey, I'm retired. Hey, sound effect boy. <laughs> That's not an excuse. <laughs> no, I'm retired. I don't make sound effects anymore. Childish. I'm an adult now. No, I'm a grown up and I've retired. I don't make sound effects anymore. Childish. I've thought about this a few times. And I've I've absolutely changed and grown a lot over the last 20 years. I think I've I've gotten a little more mature, I've mellowed out a lot, definitely. But there is one thing that I will never stop doing until I'm a hundred. And that's making fucking sound effects. It's just never gonna ha that will never stop happening. You ever gonna do a rumble again? Uh, I mean, here, here's the thing about stuff like that. This We've done so many rumbles that if I ever do one, if I ever wanted to do one, I'd want to make sure it was good and kind of worth doing because when you do enough of them, because th there's all kinds of characters that are made and all kinds of situations and uh, the new games are kind of, they're not really as, I don't know, they don't really scratch the itch for me anymore as they used to. Like ever since like 2K14, 2K13, 2K15, those games in particular, I mean, they kind of just don't really do it for me anymore. And I'm one, I'm, I'm a kind of, I mean, you, you, those of you that have been here for like 10 years, 12 years, 
I don't like to do stuff just to do it. Like, I don't want to, I don't want to just do a rumble just to like, okay, yeah, let's do a rumble. Of course we're going to do it. And it's like, yeah, that was, that was all right, I guess. I want them to be all like fun and, and entertaining and interesting and engaging. I just don't want to do them just to do them because then you kind of like just phoning it in. It's like, do them, do them. We got to do them every year, every six months. So yeah, if it ever happens again, it will. If not, then I'm happy with the ones that have happened. All right, what do we got to do? Okay, I run a small bookshop by the beach. My girlfriend is a barista and we would like to make space for her coffee shop. New furniture to buy and a wall to paint. Are you still Jerma or are you Jerry? Um, I think, I think Jerry is Jerma. Okay. Yes, what? It's a big reveal. That's like a, we're in season 13 of Jerma 985. That's a big, that's a major late into the series plot reveal. We're in season 13. Gee, what? And then I'm going to turn the stream off now. I'm leaving you on a, on a cliffhanger. Oh, time to paint. The paint roller. Every flipper's best friend. To paint a wall, you must buy some paint. Yep, store. Take the paint. Yeah, you aim at the bucket. I think it's probably just like the first one. Okay, how to make sure you're not going over the line. Set the painting area first. Click on the wall to set your starting point. Move towards the end point and press to set, this, to set the area. Oh! Oh, that is... what? That's a great change. That's a great change, honestly. Because then you can just... You don't have to worry about this wall or the ceiling or yeah, that's great. This house kind of freaks me out. Anybody else like get, like getting kind of freaked out by this house? I don't know. To, in my brain, is like there's a lot. So many like colors. It's like this reds, blues, greens, oranges, yellows, pinks, purples, orange, teal, magenta. I am so boring. I am a gray, navy, and black. Gray, navy, white, and black. The landlord special. <laughs> yeah, but like a, a nice navy in that, like the, the navy kind of spectrum. They have a bidet. Oh, no, they don't. It's that. Wait, they do. What is that? Do you shit in this? Wait, what is this? Wait, hold on. That's not a bidet. No, no, that's not a bidet. It's a ball washer? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> I don't know. It could maybe it, there's probably a function for it. Are we selling? We're only selling the bed. So you want to sell the bed, and then you want this. I gotta spend twenty seven hundred bucks. Plastic. <laughs> give him a plastic bed. Just a plastic bed with a plastic mattress and plastic pillows. Ah, gray. Ah. Perfect. This bed kind of looks sad. And I mean literally. I don't mean like, oh, there's something... It, this, this bed kind of looks like it is it is sad. Almonder Wi-Fi. Almonder. Almonder Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. Almonder. Oh, that's like... It's like a seven-year-old reference. I, I'm, I'm doing this to enrage you, so I just want to make sure that I'm very clear about it. You know what it is? I don't really like patterns for furniture or for walls. I think that's why this, I don't really, I don't, I don't really vibe with this place at all. I don't like patterns. I like solid or gradients or accents. I don't really like patterns. You're boring. That's all right. Hey, hey, look, if we're, if you and I were neighbors, I can have my just clean gradient, gray, blue, you know, some greens, some oranges, that's fine. You are free to, in the privacy of your own home, make a fucking Dr. Seuss house. That is, that's up to, if you vibe with that, that's how you vibe. See, I, I am just bad with design, right? Because I don't know what to do with all this. Like who, who, okay, where do you... When I'm thinking about where people are sitting, right? Like, if you're sitting here, you want to put your feet up here, and then you put your put your fucking food on this, or this has to you over here because you can lounge this way. I my feng shui is off, and then this is this is like a little table that goes kind of like right here. The radiator's right there, though. I gotta be careful. I don't. Okay. No, that's no. What is that? 
This is a table? This is a chair? What is this? It's a footrest? I, I feel like that's not big enough. Look at how big my legs are. Maybe it is big enough. Thanks for... Items for sitting on. Yeah, I would probably sit on that. I don't know. This is, this is, this is like the arm wrestle table. Like... Ugh! Or like this way. How is that even a good arm wrestling chair? I don't know. You could use it. It's a little dirty in here. <laughs> okay, let's go. What the hell? You just poisoned the food. How <laughs> is vacuuming poisoning? There's not another setting that you flip on the vacuum to have it be a spray poison mist mode. What about the bacteria on the vacuum? Yeah. Poison damage vacuum. That sounds kind of like a fun weapon. That's like a fun D&D &D custom weapon. Okay, for one second, out of the corner of my eye, I saw the yellow circle over here. And I thought there was somebody in that room. I just had a half a second freak out like what is it who's in there you're not matching them with the color what are you what are you doing you didn't match them with the what are you fucking doing stop just fucking relax guys it's so funny so i mean all the grades were just for fun right but i remember uh the critique I gave to Will Neff about the, you know, no spoilers, were, oh, yeah, I don't like the, uh, the spacing of this. The only critique that I have, the only critique that I have is I, 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 I may have wanted to see the tables, maybe, maybe uh, spread out a little more. Mm. Because the, the, I, I feel like if I sit here, I, I don't want to sit next to this asshole. You know what I mean? I, g right. give, give me, give me like two tables, get it. I don't want to sit next to fucking two people. Too, too Got close it. for me. I, I, yeah. I like spread out restaurants. Although you did only have a small space and you worked with it well. Thank you. Thank you. That, that is an 87. Beautiful. Thank you. This is exactly, exactly the same. This is the exact same distance that he had his spacing and I criticized him for it. You should retroactively boost his score. <laughs> Irwin did a great job. It was... It was great. There was such a great balance of wacky and crazy and informative and fun and interesting it was i was very happy yeah i am I, okay i want to be able to i want to be able to do the the tom cruise slide into frame with my socks on you can't do that in this place to me the ha there always has to be in any place that i ever occupy at least like six straight feet of slidable material are you the imposter of sus guy no that's my twin brother jerry he sucks, by the way. We have a whole sibling rivalry thing. Rivalry. We have a whole sibling rivalry thing going. I'm so much more, like, chill and, and mellow. He's just fucking annoying. How do people design places? Like, restaurants and coffee shops and how... Like, look, I, what do I do with these? Oh, no, I forgot. That, that's the a, that's a chocolate chip and toffee ice cream pattern. It's not dirty. Someone threw up their coffee. <laughs> it's it's a, a clown puke. Bah. Particle board. Yeah, yeah. Make a, uh, make a, make a place for the kids to play. But make sure it's the cheapest shit possible. Um, excuse me, uh, sir. For for an extra six dollars, we could make it not particle board. I don't give a fuck. Okay. What is he doing? I'm, I don't know. I'm just fucking around. 
I don't get scored on this. You just have to put it here. Yeah, we're good. He's trying so hard to be funny. I'm like, look, ready? Oh my god, I put this funny thing in here. <laughs> I better see a ton of XDs. It was wicked funny. What is going? What is this? Is this a, is a garden or is this a? Is it? It's a, is it a grave? No, it's a garden, right? Yeah, this is a garden. This is a garden. This is a garden. This is a garden, guys. <laughs> it's a garden. Yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, that's that's very that feels very nice. This will be leveled up too, but this I like this. It scared the shit out of me for some reason. What's dirty here? Windows, you idiot. Time that person out for one second. Done. Nice. Almost 10,000 coins. Furnishing homes is one of the flipper's basic tasks. And now you can learn how to assemble furniture on your own. Open the assembly tab and see which courses are available. Finishing them will give you a store discount for the same type of items you learned how to assemble. Welcome to your first assembly course. First, gather the parts, open the boxes. Open the box you see around the room to put the parts in your inventory. Then look for assembly icons and press left click. Okay, go through the steps and use the parts you've gathered to assemble an item. You can move the camera with right click. Okay, I think, I think I fucked it up already. Control. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, okay, control left. What? Okay, this is kind of fun. I like this. I just want to see what happens. Cool. Am I going to be able to build couches and beds and bookshelves and... Oh, can I restart? You, it actually is important that you do it right. Stop on the green. I know, I was just thinking if I could break it. Every picture frame has a lower price in the store. To unlock new assembly courses, finish more jobs from your emails. Remember to check the course list from time to time to see what new courses are available. Uh, let me do that one again. You can speed run these. That's so funny. I wonder if people are going to do that. All right, we got to go. Go. Done. Too slow. Under 10 seconds. I feel like there's a lot in this game. Will you make another saw house? I will make... Yeah, I'm going to make a custom house 100%. Would you ever make a podcast? No. Uh, I'm this. I'm doing a podcast essentially right now. If I did a podcast, it would be what you're watching right now, Sans video game. It'd be it would, it would be almost identical. Dude, Sans is gonna be in a video game. <gasps> Do you hear the first part of that song? I love it. It's like my favorite song. You know what a fun game show would be. If you, I don't know if it would be like a segment of a game show, but having people need to recognize a song by a half second snippet of the song, I think would be kind of fun. Just like a da 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 da, done. Like, what was that? It already exists. What's it called? I, I'd love to see it. I think that's interesting. But I'm not, okay, I'm not talking about a full 30 seconds of the song, or even 10 seconds of the song, because that's kind of, you know, if you know music, if you know a lot of bands, that's not that hard. I'm talking the equivalent of the from uh, Sans song. What song is this? What <laughs> song is this? Listen up, folks. <laughs> what? <laughs> what song is this? 
you got to give more than a tenth of a second. What song is this? It's called, what is it called? Hurdle. Hurdle. I'll look it up. Ludwig was playing it the other day. Really? I'll have to check it out. They have to guess the song based on one note. Is a show like that? No, that, I don't know. That would be, that would be impossible. You're talking about one piano key? I don't know. How would you get, how would you get it? Don't you not listen to any music ever? How would you play it? Um, it's not, not ever. Just, I don't really use music for background noise because it distracts me from whatever I'm doing. If I'm writing or concentrating on something or music is a part of my brain that just pays attention to the music and does not allow me to pay attention to anything else. If I'm going to listen to music, I'm listening to music. I'm sitting down, putting headphones on, and that is, that is what I'm doing. I know a lot of people like write papers and do work and stuff with music, but it just, it adds extra time to my job I'm doing just because the, the amount of time I have to pause for a second and be like, oh, hold on, this, I like this part. Oh, I did get perks, right? You're the fastest cleaner in Pina Cove. I'll take it. The roller uses less paint. It's very effective, very efficient. Did I say efficient? Is efficient? What word did I just say? That's why I use elevator music, because it's all the same and gets me in a brainwashed corporate mindset. Jeez. SimCity 4 music is really good for that. You definitely listen to, like, the Muppets. Uh... I mean, Aurora Borealis shining down on Dallas. Can you picture that? You know what's really funny? And I know that, like... The, 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 oh, the meme. Uh -huh. Germ is a cartoon character, right? I know, I've seen it all. Uh, but it is kind of funny that I, I genuinely do think that Dr. Teeth and the Electric Mayhem is one of the, like, the best, my favorite bands. I think they have, like, great music. They've got some real bangers. They're very, very good. I just like Dr. Teeth a lot. He's, uh, Dr. Teeth is one of my favorite Muppets. He might even be my favorite Muppet. I love the way, I just love the way he talks. I love that, like, well, I, let me, excuse me, let me say something real, I, I do say. It's kind of like that, that Goku. It, I love that. I love that kind of style of, um, character. Grown-ass man loves the Muppets. <laughs> <laughs> Can you picture, you gotta see it in your mind. Can you picture, it's easy and hard to, it's not hard to find. Can you picture that? Can you picture that? Hey, Floyd, take a verse. Just go listen to Can You Picture That right now. Just do it right now. They've performed that song live. Weren't they at... Okay, am I misremembering this? Or was Dr. Teeth and Electric Mayhem one of the bands that performed at Coachella a few years ago? I, that's real, right? They actually did that, didn't they? What was it? You're off your rocker right now. I swear to God, they were at some major music festival. You one guy yourself. No, I, 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 I think that's accurate. Let me see. I really think that's, that's a real thing. Dr. Teeth. Live. Okay, they've, they've been at the Lands, Lands concert 2016. They've been, uh, no, they definitely, they've been somewhere else. They've been in a lot of places. Dr. Teeth live. I'm going to write just write Coachella. Lands Concert 2016, I think is what it was. Muppets at Coachella. I'm this is a Reddit thread. I'm pretty sure Dr. Teeth and Electric Mayhem played outside Lands a few years back. Huh. <laughs> that's not a, no, that's not a Muppet festival. Well, it wasn't Coachella, but it was, it was like a big music festival. I'm sure you guys will find it. The Wiggles are at a lot of concerts, too. <laughs> the Wiggles perform at Coachella. You gotta shake. You gotta shake. You gotta shake your hips when you get out of bed. Move around. I think I'd be a great wiggle. The alternate universe? I think I'd be a pretty good wiggle. I would do one show, though. Get exhausted, hate it, and never do it again. And I would, I would have them, like, kill me off or something. Like, canonically kill me. <laughs> Introducing the new performer. Hey, everybody, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. We like we uh, he didn't want to do it anymore. He, we have to uh, we have to canonically kill uh, Jerma as the new uh, fucking children's performer. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow tomorrow morning, ten a.m.
Take care of yourselves. I will see you bright and early at 10 a.m. Pacific. What's your favorite Muppet movie? Uh, in no particular order, the first one, the original Muppet movie, Muppets from Space, and um, probably Muppet Christmas Carol. Yeah, Muppet Treasure Island is is very close too, though. I just like uh, the bear in um, Muppets from Space. Oh yes, General. Oh yeah. Okay. Are we seeing a theme here? I love characters that kind of talk like this. General, well, here's our new retinal scanner. You should raid Stir. Stir swimming. Stir is live now? Oh, it is like 2 o'clock, yeah. Yeah, we'll raid Stir. Go say congratulations, Stir. What is he doing? What's Stir up to today? Explain the finals. Well, don't annoy him. Yeah, yeah. don't don't annoy Stir. Because when I raid Stir, it's just like, sometimes he DMs me and he's like, hey, that was annoying. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's never happened. All right. Say hi to Stir. Be good. Tell him that his house flipper house was hysterical. Yeah. Take care. See you soon. Have a great rest of your day. I mean, it's so it's actually kind of weird to be like, hey, have a good night. No, it's it's daytime. All right. Take it easy, guys. Have a good rest of your day. See you guys tomorrow. 10 a.m. More house flipper. Have a great day. Germa raid. Germa? You can talk to me about it! <laughs> you can talk to me about Germa! The rats are coming. I'll prepare for the rats. Uh, I know I'm ready. Okay, I'm ready. I'll give them the uh, subway surfers. They'll be here for hours. They won't even realize it's a loop. Put on the cat ears. Mm. I don't know. I feel like that's a net. It, this is too dark. <laughs> Germa? Germa985? Congratulations. Did he tell you the big news? Did he tell you the big news? Germa has sent it to you. Me and Germa are getting married. It's going to be in a chapel. With the Elvis Presley impersonator. Uh, he had told me that if I won the event, then uh, then we could finally do it. Uh, if you had a Freaky Friday body switch with Germa, what would you do? Uh, if I had a Freaky Friday switch with Germa, I would, I would immediately go to the bathroom and poop and see what it's like. We all just did. Did we all just say that? Is that like a common thing? Can I not poop? No, Germa has uh, his Crohn's. I just you know walk a mile in his shoes. Is that way that when we unfreaky Friday that I could relate to him better and be like, yeah, man, that that was rough. It was rough on the toilet. <laughs> you guys think I just want to shit just so I can see see what <laughs> see what. But you would wear a maid outfit while in Germa's body. I want to do things that I could only do while I'm Germa, which is like shit. <laughs> I, I, I like what else? What else? Uh, the second thing I'd do is I'd go tell Holly like, hey, listen, uh, just a heads up here. I don't want any weird shit going on. Uh, Hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, hold on, maybe I'm actually uh, talking like a little bit now, uh, hold on there, uh, I'm not actually Germa, I'm actually Stir, <laughs> wait, no, <laughs> you're gonna think this is crazy, no, yeah, yeah, no, actually, uh, she wouldn't, she wouldn't believe me if I did it like that, I would, I, I would, I would, uh, I would seek help, I would, I would shit, and then I would seek help, that's the conversation, and, um, I don't know, probably, Fucking lay back and play something on Game Pass. Was uh was it a good time with German the uh, the house flippers today through the the actual single player? Why can't I click play? I was curious how the actual like uh, I didn't play House Flipper one how the actual game was going. Germa said you find us <laughs> did 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 Germa say I find you annoying? And also who is us? Kinda <laughs> did he <laughs> jokingly. <laughs> He said you shit talk us in DMs. I don't think I don't think Germa on stream would say stir shit talks you guys. Hey, hey, Jay guys. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna raid stir and uh 
yeah, be nice because he fucking hates you guys. So like, be on your best behavior because he doesn't like you. <laughs> I don't think that's what happened. Pull up the clip. He actually can I can I get a clip? Uh, hold on, I'm just gonna go to his stream and go to the end. Well, don't annoy him. Yeah, yeah, don't don't annoy Stir because when I raid Stir, it's just like sometimes he DMs me and he's like, hey. <laughs> That was annoying. <laughs> That's actually true, though. I'm that kidding. That did happen. He's happened. not, right. he's not kidding. That good. did happen one time. I didn't DM him. We had a joking conversation about it. He, he raided me one night. It was like two in the morning, my time. And I was playing Overwatch. And I said, I, I, that, that stream... <laughs> It wasn't about you. It was about the expectations of how many people are going to watch you like sit on a toilet and play again. We're on the toilet, sit on the toilet and just like, well, I'm just playing Overwatch guys at 2 a.m. This was like my like, uh, where I, I haven't played this map more than once. This is Vegas, by the way. This is where Jerma lives. Like not literally this is where he lives in this giant, long, uh, mostly abandoned hospital. It looks like go to his house. Hold on. I know where it is. They modeled it in. If I find it all, I'll point it out. Don't let out the context. Andy's kick me out of context. I immediately said it was all made up. It wasn't made up. It wasn't made up. Yeah, I was just uh, before you raided, actually, I was talking about how much your stream needed me and that you like begged me to be on the house flipper stream because you knew that like you needed it. And we did it for you. It's true. <laughs> Damn. I thought there was going to be like a like a no. Uh, glad you could, you, uh, we could help. I feel like we, uh, we raised the bar on the others. That, like, after we crushed round one, and I think everyone else was like, hold up, hold on a second. We gotta build. Jesse. Jesse. It's time to build. 